five things that you missed in Google Tech's new update. Like this chimney right here that is connected also inside of right here as well. See, Gorilla Tech has done a lot of stuff in the Christmas update. I'm here to cover every single secret. I know that you can smash ornaments on the ground. Bruh. Keep in mind, the update has been out for a couple days. You will know some stuff, but some stuff you might not know. Like knowing that 65% of you guys who watch don't even subscribe. Yes, there's a lot of stuff from last year. Some of it changed a little. You, you said what? Make Hello? sure to subscribe again. Oh, you told him to subscribe again? Come on. No, I already told him. Did you tell him about the eyesore that's over here in the uh, globe? <laughs> this is the maze and city for the dungeon. So without further ado, let's get on with number one. Every mini map in the game. Oh boy, there's a lot here. So, whoa, whoa, I just flew. Bruh. Wait, put my hand right under here. And I grab the thing right here. I can't go small. What the heck? Oh my God. There's about too many maps in every single map. Well, except dungeon, the city map, down caves, nor the sky jungle. Whoa, glitched inside of. Oh my God. Oh, I just glitched inside. No, this was an intentional on purpose. Can I just slip outside the map? Nope. But where they are, forest, oh. hidden down in the beach map, oh. inside the desert, oh. mountains, not once, but... <laughs> two times- wait, this isn't a mini-map. It's not all of the mini-maps, you can actually shrink things and maybe even shrink Doug the Bug. Now, the way to actually get in is not even hovering your thing around, you have to grip it, and basically it'll put you on it. You can actually grip the train and stay on it like this, or you can phase through it. Now as you go outside of the map, it basically goes your bigger, but so does the snowballs and everything in your hand. But if I find Doug the Bug, I can go ahead in here, grab this thing, and Doug the Bug is now tiny with me. Oh, you can't see it. Bruh. Doug the Bug, as you can see, is super tiny as well as I am. But if I let him go, and crap. Oh my god, Doug the Bug's so fast, and he's tiny now. Oh. I think I just lost Doug the Bug. So if I grab one of these, I walk out, and I throw this up in the sky as far as I can. Oh god. I need Doug. Well, I killed Doug the Bug with T. He's roaming around really quickly. Try face up and see how it works. Oh, another thing with this mini map is this is from the slide betas, basically allowing you to uh, slide. Bruh. This beta was released in 2021. And you can't go straight through here. I think you can do it while you're tiny. So we got tiny, and now I'm gonna go straight through this thing. Wait, what? On to number two. You're probably wondering why there's a bunch of. These hooks and ornaments laying around everywhere. I just figured out the craziest thing. So this tree has a lot of things to hang ornaments. And there's a secret slide door. So I'm wondering if I... If you grab them, basically, since you can just smash them on the ground and they break. Or if you even want to, you can check them at other pegs and try to hook it on them. That'd be a pretty cool minigame, but there's something even darker and deeper to this. These tree lights are actually off. So let me... Oh. Does the door open here? Hello? Nope. It's time to see if this slide is useless or these ornaments are useless. The top of this tree is spinning. So I got inside this Christmas tree and basically I'm doing this for nothing. I don't know what the ornaments actually do. But as you can see, there's still nothing connecting to this uh, slide. Yeah, I tried again for I don't know what reason, but there's not enough. So let's get on to number. Every single AI has a cosmetic. Starting with Doug the Bug. This is Christmas hat, which actually has physics when you shake it. Uh, a little bit math to bat is better, but they have sure have something. Now, I did call this and I asked for this in one of the fiction videos I did, and it finally got it. I'm so happy. Can you hang Doug the bug? Bruh. Aw. All my fellas. Aw. As you can see, they both have top hats, and his actually moves downwards when you do this. Hat the bat finally has one as well. Who's the first one to get a change inside any update, actually? He got the red eyes inside the Halloween update, and now he has a top hat. Oh. That's Santa hat. Oh. Bruh. The bat. Explode. It's about to disappear in 3, 2, 1. Oh. You're probably thinking to yourself, what if the AI could have a Santa hat? Well, you said, Lucy, you would be, well, incorrect. Yay, I got a cool new toy train. Yeah, this is so cool. I, I love my new toy train. This is absolutely awesome. No one can ever. Lucy! A little off sidetrack. I, I did something and this ramp appeared, so I don't know how I did this exactly. I don't know if this is part of the secret or what I did. Bruh. I'm so confused what this could even be for. If it's not to get up to a slide, then what is it for? I'm losing my mind! Like, this didn't light up or spin until I put an ornament on it. So I'm thinking it's like a secret because, like, basically you do this and it's like the walk through here, right? So I've been trying super tiny and go down. Whoa! Wait. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Yes, the monsters in here have hats, and they have the evil Santa hat. Along with the beards, which also have physics, which can jiggle when they turn. Yeah. Oh. Really off for number three, so, I mean, number four is literally just this stuff and a bunch of map changes. 
This, absolutely used for nothing, I don't know what it's for, but the thing that you miss, you can do something with them. Not only is it super fun to spam and put confetti everywhere, you can also do paintball with it. Wait, people are just gonna get small and you can't hit them. Well, this guy has a tongue out, what the heck? He's floating with it. You guys uh, know you can like fly up there. Whoa, there's a snowball fight. You can Stop lagging. Okay. Wait, what is he? Oh, you can! Yeah, you can! This. Dunked on the top. You just got dunked! Done! Ah! That's really it besides the snowballs on every single map, and paintball is a little bit funner now. Number five! That's mad, that transition was probably horrible. <laughs> Yes, it's literally the same layout at Thanksgiving, but they have these. Now I have 13,200 shiny box. And this update has some pretty good cosmetics. Now I have 1,200 shiny box. I'll spend money on the game, but uh, I might. Also, this is kind of the new fit for now. By the way, I, I'm going to be wearing this a lot. This is one of the first physics-based uh, holdables that you have now. So that's a... That's a Thing you missed Bruh. the dreidel basically when you put it close to the ground it'll do this thing basically when you lift it up as you can see it changes and you have points once you do that you click sometimes sometimes it doesn't want to work like here but if you go right here the point is you can spin it anywhere and basically if you spin it up here it, it won't even go downhill that's all like comes straight back also you have, but if i place it down right here and i run to mountains it's in floats as you can see it's just spinning and floating right now which is absolutely insane uh, i don't know i don't know this cosmetic probably, yes, uh, also I'm not done. If you get super tiny and you place the dreidel down and you get out of it, like such, you'll see that the dreidel also raises, unlike everything else that you pick up. This cosmetic seriously is one of the most amazing cosmetics ever. I really enjoy this. This is just literally a reskin of the gold helmet and the present box mix. The whistle can be played from the bottom. I'm gonna try to get outside the map and, oh, go, go, go. And see if there's anything out there. Day and it's only been daytime. But if you change Gorilla Tag to night, oh my lord, it looks amazing. This is probably one of the best sceneries you can have in Gorilla Tag because all the shading that they did last update in the fall is paying off for this update. It looks beautiful and absolutely amazing. No Santa Claus though. Look how magical that looks. That looks so cool back there. All the shading really paid off from the fall update. I'm glad they're testing that stuff. Go, go. I dug into my presents early and I grabbed myself some rockets. Oh, oh my god, let's see if there's anything out here. There's tutorials gone, and there is absolutely nothing inside this beautiful map. Now, the outside is being very, very lackluster. The inside is absolutely amazing and beautiful. I do like the simplistic design and how there's basically nothing, absolutely nothing anywhere. Even Lucy sticks out at night, and it honestly looks cool with the lights. So honestly, ah!